welcome back to Dear Teen Diary. Welcome back to my attic. With that being said, we have poetry. <clears throat> 78. I stand alone in a large white box, looking out at people. People who can't look in. I cry. All the people know is a girl is inside. When they can't understand, she's too different from them. I cry. I wish to be known by the boy I wait for. He will not see the box. He will see me, if he is. I cry. I stand alone. My tears have run dry. I've stopped waiting. He's not coming. I will never cry again. Greta Colburn. January 1st, 2000. And then I drew the box which I am in. <laughs> well, clearly at this point, I am starting to feel isolated from my peers and I am waiting for someone who will understand and accept me. And society has convinced me that that will be my boyfriend that I will have, which will make everything okay. <laughs> So cute. You know, dogs are like, I would say, probably 80% more likely to fix all of your sorrows than boys. Um, or people, people in general, not just men. So at this point, we have completely abandoned the rhyme. I think there's a few near rhymes. I, I remember really enjoying the way one they can't understand, she's too different from them, sounded. Because there's the N and the M, which are similar, but of course there's the D, but understand. The D sort of fades off. I don't know. I think I was trying to... What? Pregnant boobs itch. Um, trying to play a little bit with assonance, but not having any idea what it is or how to do it, actually. One thing that I wish I knew about at this point was the use of blank space in poetry. Because we go right from, oh, you know, like, he'll see me, if he is, I cry, to, I stand alone, my tears have run dry, I have stopped waiting. And I remember thinking that, like, a great amount of time had passed, and if I had skipped a few lines in here, that would be represented. However, I jump from the end of one stanza up here just directly to the next but you know if we had left a few blank it would have stood in contrast to the rest of the line breaks it would have been a beautiful thing um i'm gonna go ahead and toss the next few entries actually on this video which you'll see why uh it's because up next we have 79 this gypsy which i named meryl dessa um and I drew her on January 2nd of 2000. And then the next one just is clearly a guilt entry. An entry I wrote because I felt bad for not writing in such a long time. I have no idea what time or how long it's been. But it just says, hey, hey, Greta C here. Going great. Gotta rock it. <laughs> Uh, and then up next, a drawing, an anime drawing. You can tell that my, my skills are getting better here. I named her Kathy. Entry 82 will be a poem. It looks like it's going to be pretty decent. I would flash it to the camera, but I don't. You know, I'm sure you're like dying to freeze frame and read it ahead of time. And I'm just, I don't want to ruin it for you. <laughs> yeah, so, so entry 80. The entry 80, I just said, God damn it, Greta. Don't toss your diary across the room. Nope. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, so when we get to entry 82, there will be a link right over here that you can click, and it will take you there. And uh, all right. 
uh, go have a good day, and I'll see you around. Bye.